Hi there, everybody. Uh, this is Paul here in Wisconsin. And Peter, where are you? I'm in New York. Okay, yeah, Peter Schneider there, and hey. Paul Isaacs here. So today we want to talk to you something about very exciting. Um, we are going to demonstrate how you can remotely mix multi-channel audio over the internet from anywhere in the world. So essentially, imagine that Peter's on location um, where the actors are, and I'm somewhere the other side of the world, and I'm going to be mixing all the ISOs and recording them, and make them so that I can make them available for post. Now, this is obviously really important now because uh, we're in a world where you know productions are really looking for ways on how we can deal with um, remoting the crew members as much as possible to avoid you know COVID issues and what have you. So. <laughs> We've been looking at this very closely, Peter and I, and we've, um, we want to demonstrate this wonderful bit of software which makes this possible. There's a few other little tricks as well. And the software is called Unity Connect. But essentially what we're going to do is Peter has a Scorpio at his end. He's going to show you how he rigs it up. He's going to send me all his audio across the internet to me, and I'm going to bring it into a Scorpio my end and mix it here on the Scorpio live with really low latency and really high quality. So Peter. Yes, so uh, first of all, we're using Unity Connect software to, to connect our two cities with audio. Um, we should say that although I can see you through Zoom, our audio is coming over Unity Connect. So yeah. we're in fact eating our own dog food. And I'm just gonna show you, see behind it is the cellular router. And uh, so that cellular router is where all of the multi-channel audio is um, going through. Uh, so we really wanted to simulate, oops, there we go, simulate the worst possible internet connection on a location, which if that's gonna be your backup, um, you wanna make sure that your backup is gonna work. So uh, to take you through the uh, routing, um, we are uh, going from uh, the Scorpio into via Dante, Dante Virtual Sound Card. So I'm going to share my screen, uh, which is right here. Uh, there we go. Okay, so first stop is going to be the Dante Virtual Sound Card. Um, I'm only doing 16 channels of audio because, well, that's enough. Um, and that goes to the Dante controller. So the receiver uh, is the Mac Mini. Um, the transmitter is the Scorpio. And so that, once it gets into the computer, gets picked up by this amazing software called Unity Connect. And uh, we're just going to look at the remotes tab. So there's my computer. There's Paul. There, there are you. Uh, there's your computer. And we go to the outgoing tab. And I'm enabling channels 1 to 16 of audio. And uh, we're at the in this case, it's the highest latency of audio, and you can have different levels of compression. Um, it's worth noting that this uses the Opus codec, and uh, it is qu uh, quite an excellent codec, and audio is kind of the mid-level um, compression. Um, from there, I am receiving a comms channel from Paul. So if I go back, if I go to the incoming tab, um, Paul's comms are coming into me, and I'm sending it out uh, these Dante channels. Uh, and my mix uh, left and right is also going out. And yeah, you can combine, which is really nice. So I can hear a mix of Paul and of um, uh, of the return and that's going into my Scorpio bus one and that's how I'm hearing uh, never returning Paul's audio back to Paul um, and so speaking of back to Paul that is what's going on on our end okay. I guess I should mention uh, Hamachi Connect um, yes. Hamachi Connect and I'll just share the screen one more time um, Hamachi Connect log me in Hamachi uh, is a wonderful piece of software. Um, my uh, kids knew it and a, a bunch of the people in the office knew it because it's what you can use Minecraft servers for. It basically allows Paul and I to connect our computers without worry of any firewall issues. Um, you might know cellular connections might, are usually restrictive in terms of opening ports. This bypasses that completely. With because it's a mesh arrangement, um, very very little penalty in terms of latency. So that's what we got. 
Okay, so let me show you what's going on at my end now. I'm going to share my screen. So it's pretty much the reverse of what Peter has just described. Um, so here you can see uh, my Unity Connect here. And let's just take a look at the tabs up here. So here's Peter. This is Peter's computer in New York. And here's the incoming streams that he's sending me. And this audio is totally in sync. You know, it's sample sync. So um, I've got a, a buffer here. Um, it's a pretty small buffer. Um, you know, if you're going to be working to video anyway, you're going to end up with probably <laughs> a good second's worth of delay on the video. So the audio delay is not an issue at all. Um, but anyway, here's the, the 16 channels, and you can see the signal on the meters here that Pete's sending me. And I have them routed through to 1 through 16 on my, on my uh, Mac sound card, which is Dante Virtual Sound Card. So now, um, all I need to do is, um, in Dante Controller here, um, you can see that I've got my Dante Virtual Sound Card channels 1 through 16 routed through to my Scorpios channels 1 through 16, and I'm picking them up on my Scorpio and mixing on my CL16 just here. And there's one other thing I'd like to show you here, the outgoing tab. Now here, um, this is what I am sending back to Peter. And I've set up um, channel 15 channel fifteen on my Scorpio to be my um, comms. So I'm sending that, I've labeled it. In fact, you can label all the streams backwards and forwards on Unity Intercom. So there's no guesswork at either end what you're receiving and transmitting. Um, I'm also sending him back my live mix so that if he wants to hear that mix, he can. So I'm just going to stop that share now. And let's actually get some audio going on those um, 16 yeah. channels. We're uh, very lucky to have Jason <laughs> Pena agree to play guitar for us. Uh, Jason, do you mind uh, sitting in? All right. Um, so this is just a, a, a Sanken MS mic that we've set up. Um, and uh, yeah, we'll, we'll, uh, we've duplicated it across channels from 1 to 2 across to 3 through 14. And uh, here it is. Nice. I always very have good. to. Thank I you. always have to have the last word. Very nice. Thank you. Yeah, lovely. So um, yeah, we could actually jam remotely if we wanted to, but we've got better things to do. It's kind of amazing. Um, so and and so you know, one thing we should talk about is that th these files that are being recorded locally here on my end, they can be the high resolution files, and the files that you have can be the high, the good quality proxy files. Exactly. And, you know, I can create the dailies mix here, send it off to post very easily, and they could be on Unity Connect. Um, and we could even just transfer files, um, the raw files from Peter or my ISOs from here and the mix to post using a, a whole bunch of numerous app applications. And mm -hmm. one application I use for that actually is Team Viewer, um, mm -hmm. which I use to remote desktop, desktop into a computer um, or an Android tablet at Peter's end to remote, actually physically remote control his Scorpio. I can do that and I can also put the Scorpio remotely into file transfer mode and, ha and then drag over the files from New York to Wisconsin via TeamViewer. So really we've got all the tools you need to really do a full job uh, are sort of there in existence now. We have Unity Connect for doing the multi-channel audio. We have um, team viewer for doing the remote control along with other apps and yeah it's we're sort of there it can be done yeah 
Yeah, absolutely. Uh, amazing. Amazing. Yeah. And on that note, I think we're going to wrap up. And I'm just going to say thanks, Peter. It's always great to uh, nerd out with you. you. <laughs> and it's good to see you. Yes. Likewise. And uh, hopefully we'll get to see each other face to face soon. But everyone, if you've got any questions, you can just either call Peter or me. H- hit Take us up. Care. Yeah. Thank you. Take you care, too. everybody. Bye.